Okay, still day four, no, 13? 13. 13. Um, what I'm gonna do now, we changed oil last night, clean up my mess. I'm gonna put the tires back on this thing, bolt the axles back in it. My brother brought me a hose line block off tool for the rear end. And before I invest money in fixing these brakes, on this other stuff, I need to know that this transmission will work. I know it turns the drive shaft forward and backwards, but uh, I don't know if the truck will, if it'll push the truck. So, uh, put the wheels on it. I'm gonna roll off this hill and turn up the hill, and hopefully it'll push me up the other side, and I won't run into anything. So, uh, pray for me that we don't tear up the beautiful thing. Uh, just trying to test it. The high beam is to work. All right, we're gonna got some stops here. Hopefully we got enough brakes. We're gonna roll forward and backwards and see if it'll pull itself. Brakes are working a little bit. Are they enough to move the scarf out of the way? Maiden voyage. Now just hold it. Okay. All right. We're in drive. Got our lights on. Let off the brake. We're actually moving. How long? Oh, your, your tires you can't turn too far. Yeah. Here we're driving down my yard, and the plan is to go up to my backyard, up our little road at the lower end of the yard. And my reasoning for that was, if the brakes failed, I could go turn back uphill and could stop myself. I didn't want to drive down. It's downhill towards both my neighbor's houses and didn't want to be uh, losing control going on to my neighbor's property. <laughs> but uh, as soon as we start going uphill, there's a little ditch to cross and it would not cross it. The uh, incline and the twist was too much. It was trying to lift one rear tire off the ground because the uh, suspension was so stiff and with the open differential, it would not push itself up the hill. So we try multiple times uh, and could move back and forth, but we couldn't make any real progress. 
um, I end up deciding to uh, try to pull it. I think if it would get straightened up and get traction on both tires that it would climb. But uh, you'll see we have a boo-boo here in a minute and uh, put a little dent in the uh, hood of the truck. Go get something and pull smack to us. Okay. We'll good, be back. Good maiden voyage. In just a minute. Actually, we're going to try to go across the ditch again. Oh, well, we're going off that bank. Here Gardner realizes that uh, we did a little bit more damage than what he thought. Um, let me know what y'all would do in the comments. Would you fix it or would you leave it? It's a memory. It's the first time he's ever really had to try to tow me out and uh, do anything like that. Any kind of recovery. I've been picking on him and it's Gardner's off-road recovery. I was pulling with the chain that uh, was too short and uh, made it difficult uh, to try to pull me anyway.
itself. You won't move right here. There's no weight. There's no weight on the tires. Oh. So it'd be nice to have like a ramp or a rollback so it'd be 
Yeah, but if I had a bed, it would go better. See if we can move ourselves. Here I've realized some of my errors. Um, let more air out of the tires trying to help it uh, get a little bit of traction. And now it will move a little bit. But this is a really flat area. Uh, one tire is in grass and one's in gravel. Uh, that's been loosened up by the uh, spinning side by side earlier. But uh, we wiggle around. And get in a position where we can line up with the uh, the driveway. Um, and I'm still thinking about, you know, I know it's not going to make it in my driveway. My driveway is pretty steep at the bottom. And then it flattens out closer to the house. Um, I decide to uh, go get a longer strap instead of using the chain again to pull with. That way we have more room to maneuver when we get closer to the house and the side by side will be uh, further away from me on a less steep part of the driveway. We run and go get that and uh, hook it up and you'll see what happens next.
got to stay to the left. Very minimal dent and a little scratch here. A little Honda that could. Got the truck up the hill though. My dad made the dent, by the way. <laughs> I was on the gas, he was on the brakes. Is this a little miscommunication? But he was taking, taking um, down, when you don't have a bed and you have a really heavy spring pack and no rear locker, you have a truck that doesn't move too well. So. Here's the outro. Pound it, nog, and see ya! <laughs> it's somebody else's outro. <laughs>